is the last week of campaign for all the candidates for the coming midterm election. Some of the candidates who conducted their meeting de avance were Junjun David III, who runs for the gubernatorial position, and his running mate, acting governor Agnes Magpale, who ran for the vice gubernatorial position under the Liberal Party of Pinoy. David Magpale and Liberal Party supporters alike flocked to the campaign rally to show support to their bets this coming midterm elections on May 13, 2013. The crowd filled the grounds of Cebu Technological University in the province of Argo. In the campaign, the other candidates running for mayors, board members, and councillor positions from different provinces of the South District of Cebu gave their highlights about their platform and also showed their support to each other. Luis Hontiveros, Risa Hondeveri's nephew represent for her in the last campaign, telling the voters and supporters how he supports her aunt and to vote for her. Running Vice Governor Agnes Magpale gave her speech about her time as the acting governor of Cebu City. She also mentioned of how the money of people was used by the former suspended Governor Gwen Garcia. On the other hand, running Governor Junjun David III made a thank you speech to all the supporters and to his family. He also mentioned that there must be transparency in the government. Former Chief Justice Hilario Davide Jr. was also there showing his support to his son. UP Cebu High School Batch 81 classmates of Junjun Davide also showed their full support in his campaign. Well, uh, the, the battle cry now is really change, Kausaban, and we want to, to uh, serve the Cebuanos in the most transparent and accountable manner. Ang nahitabo sa atong lalawigan karon, wala kahibaw ang mga subuanon, dagang wala mahibaw eh. Unta, ang atong mga umaabot usab na magbabalaod uh, will produce uh, resolutions and ordinances that, as I said, top caliber. Well, uh, the Cebuanos can expect a culture of transparency and accountability in, in the provincial government. If I win, if I become governor, the Cebuanos can expect a leadership na kanang kasaligan, kanang tarong na leadership. O kanang pagpanibisyo, tarong na panibisyo, kasaligan na panibisyo sa Dinis Ato. Well, you, you know very well uh, the platform government of my son. It will be a real transformation and uh, a, new, a change for uh, the uh, prosperity, progress, peace, uh, and harmony in the province of Cebu. And especially for the, uh, the various activities related to agriculture, for instance. So, all-out development uh, for progress. Yeah.